Channing. Channing needs to get fed, I think. Don't bite me, please. Please don't bite me. You're a monster. He's staring at me like a psycho. My long runs. Hey. Hey, Channing. Hi everyone, welcome to Life Is Not A Casserole Running YouTube channel. I'm Elizabeth. I am currently training for an ultra distance, my first 50 mile race. And this week I thought it would be fun to show you a little bit of my preparing and running my back to back long runs. The main difference that I can tell between training for a marathon and training for an ultra distance is that instead of one long run per week, you get two long Long runs per week. The main purpose of back-to-back -back long runs along with building strength and endurance is to get you used to running on tired legs. The second long run simulates the later stages of an ultra marathon to train your body and your brain to run even though you are really, really, really tired. It's also much easier to recover from that high volume of mileage if it's spread over two days rather than just one epically long run. The race I am preparing for is a trail race, so ideally all of my long runs would be done on trails, however that is not reality. I live in a city, most of my running is going to be done on sidewalks and paved bike paths, that's just how it is. It takes more preparation and time for me to get to a place that has trails. Last week I did make it to Afton State Park for my 14 mile long run. Oh my gosh, look at the one with his fuzzy little antlers. Hi. But most of my training for this race is going to be urban, which also has some nature, sort of. For this week, my first long run is an 18 miler, the second is a 14 mile run, and the first thing I'm going to be thinking about is laundry. There's already enough stuff to assemble in the morning when I'm getting ready for those long runs, so having all of my laundry done, having the outfits picked out, is really going to save me some time and some mental energy in the morning. So, let's go. I have assembled outfits for my two back-to-back -back long runs and also for the yoga class that I'm planning to go to. So I'm ready for my back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back workouts. I can just get up in the morning. I don't have to think about my outfit. All good. My water bottles are clean and ready to go in the morning. I have Goo and Cliff and also this random free sample of maple syrup, which is disgusting that I got at a race. Um, so I'll be using the Cliffs for my longer run just because I have more of those left and my Goo's for the 14 mile run. for the first of my back-to-back -back long runs this morning for my 18 miles and Tony is joining me for the first six. Yes, getting some miles in after having a bit of a creaky runner's knee. So it's going well so far. That's it, my back-to-back -back runs are done this week. They're in the books and next week we get to do it all over again.